Hi there. All right. So I just seriously need to get on my soapbox here because this drives me crazy. So I see a lot of clients and they're all trying to do the right thing. And one thing I can share with you is a big mistake that many of them make. When people are going gluten free, what I see all too often before I set them straight, of course, is that they're taking the gluten out of their diet. So they're removing bread and cereal and cookies and they're replacing it with gluten-free junk food. This gluten-free stuff that's in the market, the bulk of it, I'm not saying all of them, but the large majority of the gluten-free products that are out there are made with a combination of potato starch or potato flour, rice uh, flour, corn starch, tapioca starch. It's all of these junk carbohydrate replacements that are gluten-free, but they make your blood sugar go crazy. They're certainly not nutritious, and we don't need to be consuming any more tapioca or potato starch, do we? Of course not. So I was at the local grocery store um, earlier this weekend, and you know I picked these things up because I'm actually in the process of writing my first cookbook, the OMG WTF cookbook. You know, oh my gosh, what tasty food cookbook? And I'm working on some recipes in there, and I'm like, you know, I'm gonna, I'm gonna sample the competition. I purchased these products, which I never do, and after I got home and sampled them, I know exactly why I don't, because they're made with junk ingredients. So we got tapioca starch, dried cane syrup, which is sugar. Tapioca starch, by the way, pretty much acts like sugar in your body. I mean, it has a really high glycemic response in our body. Uh, we got brown rice flour, uh, let's see, tapioca syrup, potato starch. I mean, come on, like seriously? And they, they don't even taste that good. So they taste super, uber, duper sweet. They are kind of like, they kind of like fall apart. And I can't even get them out. And they're like, they're like dry. I mean, like seriously, they're dry. They're not very good. Uh, don't care for them. So my review on them, thumbs down. So then there's another one here. I'm like, oh, I better try this. Let me try and see how these things are. Super, uber sweet, like way too sweet. This is a maple pecan chocolate chip. What's the first ingredient? Tapioca starch. Uh, okay, not a good thing. Second ingredient, dried cane syrup, sugar. Okay, then I'm moving along, same thing. Same story all over again. Brown rice flour, tapioca syrup, potato starch. I mean, not good. And the same thing. These cookies are like as dry as the Arizona desert. Like seriously, who the heck wants to eat that? So junk, just absolute junk. So when we're doing gluten free and or you know grain free, we want to really replace these these recipes with truly healthy ingredients. So when you see recipes that are using almond flour or coconut flour, for example, those are really a great place to look because. Almond flour is a real food. It's simply pulverized almonds. So this is some almond flour that I'm using to make some of my recipes. It's simply all it is is the uh, skin on the almonds removed and it's really finely ground. I find when I find use this uh, type of almond flour, it really gives us a nice texture with the baked goods. Um, so much so that when you're having you know an almond cookie made with almond flour, see how it's flaky? and it's nice and it's moist, okay? This is my chocolate chip almond flowers, or almond flour uh, recipe. It's got chocolate chips in it. I actually use chocolate chips that are sweetened with stevia, so that cuts down on the sugar load. It's made with almond flour, some vanilla, some eggs. Um, I put walnuts in there. If you don't care for walnuts, you don't have to, but you can find the recipe over on yourtastylife.com on the blog. Um, I'll post this recipe on the blog and you know pictures and so forth so you can check it out. But don't make the mistake that so many people make and replace the gluten in their diet with gluten-free junk food. Use truly healthy replacements and you'll learn more about that on your tasty life. It's something I'm pretty passionate about because I don't want you to make that simple mistake. So I'll talk to you soon, take care.